Gotcha, beat. We are calling Gabe. Get down with your bad self. It's a sideways dance. What are you doing? Let's try a different. Dance? No. I mean, you go like this. What do you get? What do you do? Hello. Hello, is this Gabe? Yes. Gabe, how are you? This is Paul, outside our tackle box radio show and podcast. We have Tommy here in the studio. He made it. Hey, what's going on, Gabe? Yeah, he's right. I did make it. Hey. <laughs> hey, how's it going? It's oh, going right. good. We are um, here on a radio show, so that can't complain. We enjoy doing it. Uh, welcome to Fish Story. Uh, the idea behind the Thanks show. Thanks for having me. Oh, absolutely. Anytime. Yes. The, the idea behind the show is to spread happiness to the world through the joys of fishing. And you sent in a photo uh, with quite a... Uh, quite a stringer. Yes. that it, there, And you're, it looks like your friend there, too, has uh, quite a bit of fish. And so we want to hear where you caught the fish, uh, what bait you were using, and the size of, of the fish, if you, if you know it. Yeah, um, that, that's actually my, my nephew, Danny. He came down from Idaho. Nice. Uh, we're down in, uh, in San Diego, actually in Escondido. Uh, and uh, we were at Dixon Lake. We were at the, at the Derby uh, that day on a Friday. And uh, he actually went first place uh, with that, uh, that little beast. Uh, oh, wow. Uh, the, I was going to say that, the, little, seven... that, that little beast? <laughs> yeah, that it was. It's, 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 it's... <laughs> yeah. That's yeah, a big a, one. A, a seven, seven 7.2, I believe, um, a, a rainbow trout, and uh, we, we 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 were we were we had a good time that day. Well, now now what and, were you, uh, what were you guys using for bait? I mean, were you just using like uh, like worms, power bait? What were you, what were you guys? Using? Tommy and I big are big um, trout fishermen, so we yeah. we love to hear stories of. Uh, and this is local too. This is somewhere well, we can some, actually drive local, to. Yeah, yeah you're about two hours south of us. Yeah, we're we're up in Orange County. We're um, in Huntington Beach, so we're not too far from you. Okay. Yeah. No, that's no, just the down, down, down south from us. Nice little cruise. Um, we were we. Yeah, there was it was a derby, so they they stocked it pretty pretty well. So, oh, nice. um, we were just using jigs. Uh, mini jigs. Um, okay. There's a local guy around here. He he makes his. Uh, his uh, his jigs. Uh, we were using the hookup baits. Okay. I don't know if you guys heard of uh, that guy, but um, hookup, yeah. We were using the yeah. Uh, we were using uh, his his uh, his uh, hookup baits, uh, yellow, and he my nephew was just killing them with, with that thing. And uh, uh, no, we we didn't use um, any power power bait because they were they were pretty active. They were out. Uh, towards the middle of the lake, which was kind of unusual for the trout because they look, they usually like their little coves and stuff. So um, you know, we were just using uh, uh, mini jigs uh, all day long. Nice. Yeah, it's always but, uh, fun. You know, as, as I get older, as I get older, I start using power bait a little bit more often, you know. But, yeah, uh, uh, yeah you know, I mean, we, we try, jigs were just... <clears throat> you know, being like trout fishermen, like, like Paul had said that we are as well, um, we try to steer clear of the power bait. Um, you know, it, it does work. Well, but we, it, yeah, it, but we do a lot of still water fishing, mostly because Tommy's lazy. He'll just throw like uh, a bait in the water and then go to sleep on there, the boat. There, the, yes, that is that is a true story. <laughs> I we went up to the Sierras and I got tired, and because we we took he just a, shared a photo on okay, on the I'm an Outsider Fishing Group, and it was wait, him wait. taking a nap. Real, real quick. Real quick, let's go back a little bit to that story, and I apologize, uh, you know, Gabe, for for interfering with yours. Well, Gabe's but, our Gabe, Gabe's no, our last no, no. caller, so we're, okay. this is he okay. could be as long as he would okay. like. As long as he chooses. Okay, yeah. so a little bit of backstory. We decided to go up to the Sierras this past uh, this past uh, opener, <coughs> and uh, Paul goes, "Okay, you know, we'll go up there. I'll drive, and then we'll swap." He drove. We About shut down a, the company because we shut down the company. It, you we know, we, we shut like, down for the weekend, no, yeah. for the for a few days. And this one decides, okay, I'm going to drive. So he drives up there for what? About an hour and a half. We got to Palmdale. Yeah. Okay. So you're going to tell the story <laughs> yeah. about how I only drove like an hour. It's like yeah. you drive the rest <laughs> yeah. of the way, and I drove the rest <laughs> of the way, all the way up to Mammoth, all the way up to uh, June Lake. We went up to June Lake. We get there, and I'm dog tired. 
and I, I we just pull into the parking lot. Um, we end up we we just slept in the in the car. My buddy told me the wrong room. Yeah, he on purpose. So I walk into somebody else's room, and it's all these fishermen. Um, it's like a whole, but it's a group and. <laughs> <laughs> we find out later that he was it just was messing with us, and, and so, so, but but we had to sleep in the car the we first slept night. In the car the first night, so we and totally then, got pranked. Wow. Yeah, and then uh, so, mind you, again, I drove like five hours, slept in the car. <laughs> this guy was sleeping most of the way up, and then slept in the car. I'm a great co-pilot. And then, like that. Yeah, and then uh, and then he has the nerve to make fun of me because we're on the boat and I put some power bait on on the hook and, and I he cast goes it to out. Sleep. <laughs> And I fell asleep on the boat, no. and I actually reeled in a fish while laying down. I like that all you could have said was I was tired, but you, no, you spent the, the last story. two minutes I had to tell explaining the whole story. how you were how you're just tired. You just gave up on me the whole <laughs> <laughs> And then you're like, oh, look at Tom so lazy. He's catching fish laying down. Yeah, I, I drove the whole way. So my version well, of that story is is that he's asleep on the boat. He gets a a fish on the line, but he's sleeping. He um, I I yell at him and I say, "Hey, you got a fish?" He just rolls over and yes. starts reeling. And I brought and I caught wow. I happened to catch him in that moment, and I t I took a picture, and so I was explaining to everybody. Uh, I'm so glad he shared that <laughs> that that photo because I was like, you you have to hear how he caught that. He was asleep. <laughs> I didn't even move. I just kind of rolled over, oh, reeled yeah. it up. But yeah, no. Uh, so, <laughs> but yeah, you know, like I was saying, like when we do a lot of still water fishing, we do, we, you know, we'll use a power bait, but most of the time we try to use. Well, we get people. And... We get we get people who make their own power bait, and we like to test uh, the products before we, we put them in our we boxes, do. and so. We use a little bit of everything, and um, I'm, I'm a power bait guy yeah. too. I, I but I I prefer catching them on on the lure on the on jig the on lure, the... and the, I think it's just fun. It's a little bit more activity. Yeah. It, it uh, is fun. It is fun. It, you know, you're you're casting, and you know, it, it's a little bit more work. You have to work at it, and I like that challenge. Exactly. You know, exactly. You're just sitting there waiting for it to yeah. come. Honestly, some yeah, of them, I some I, I love catching them on like a, like a spinner bait, like a rooster tail or something like that, because something about mm -hmm. that bite just seems a little bit more a uh, little bit more vicious when they hit it. Mm -hmm. You know, it yeah. just it just it, it it's That's true. a little bit more exciting. You know, it's just rather than just yeah. watching your rod tip a little bit, it's it's more fun to just feel it, bam, hit. Yeah. Yeah. <clears throat> but no, I. I yeah. That's awesome. So you guys were. In... We haven't been to Dixon, and that's not too far no, from we, us. We need to go. Yeah. To no, go. You, you know what? You guys should come down. Um, it's a good lake for bass fishing too. It's oh, perfect. My, my personal, it's my favorite uh, lake to down here to to go bass fishing. Nice. Um, they have really nice, good size. Uh, average is about three pounds. Mm. And um, yeah, it's a good lake. Good luck, you guys can try it. Is uh, several lakes down here? Is it is it um, sorry boat or shore or just kind of everywhere? You know what? If we go down there, because uh, it's so everywhere. close, we're gonna give you a call and just be like, where do we go, or when definitely, are you going? Definitely. <laughs> yeah, let's just meet up. Where are we yeah, going? Definitely. First off, where's a good spot for definitely. breakfast burritos? Yes. And the next spot is where's where is the beer? liquor store? <laughs> and then where's the lake? <laughs> <laughs> yeah, where are the fish? Where are the fish? Yeah. <laughs> we need footage. Escondido, Escondido, Anejos is the restaurant you guys should go hit up. Uh, it's a See bar, it. bar and grill. There we go. Um, it's still, and that's an Escondido. And, uh, Gabe, yeah, Gabe was ready to answer all those here. questions. <laughs> <laughs> that's awesome. Yeah, yeah no, for yeah. sure. We would definitely come down and, and, and fish with you, Gabe, and yeah. just have a good Anytime. time. And... You guys... You guys are always welcome to come down here. I actually live in, uh, I just moved up to Temecula, which is uh, 30 minutes away from here. And yeah. there's several. Oh, you're uh, moving closer to us. Yeah. I'm headed uh, to yeah. Riverside, um, kind of Moreno Valley on the way out there today. I got a Christmas party. Okay. Yeah. But yeah, yeah, we visit Temecula at the wineries and. Oh, yeah. Yeah, the wife. Yeah, yeah I, 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 I live in the. Uh, I live in Old Town, so you know on weekends it gets it gets pretty uh, pretty crazy over here. Oh yeah. To to go party or to you know listen to live music, it's, it's, it's awesome down here. Yeah, 
See, I'm, yeah. you're you're close to us, man. He's well, a local. We definitely, yeah. yeah, we should definitely get together. Yeah, there's a yeah, couple of lakes, in, you know. There's a couple of lakes, uh, uh, you know, up in like Redlands that we go to. Um, you know, there's Yakaipa. Diamond Valley. I, I we've done Diamond Valley. Yeah, Lake I mean, too. Just shoot straight up and go down. Yeah. A lot of small little the, the small parks too. We do a lot of that oh, stuff. Yeah. Oh yeah, there's a lot of cool little things around yeah. there. But yeah, no, definitely, Gabe. We'll have yeah. to we'll have to give you a call. We'll get together. We'll have some beers. Did we'll we have some burritos. Give Gabe his fish story. Did did oh, uh, because he? I don't know. I felt like we were talking. Like we I did. Just, we I... we just started talking like we were talking to you know our buddies. But I don't you know we don't want to take away from Gabe's fish story. I know that it, he well, was Gabe, telling us about Gabe... his unwillingly became one of our buddies. Oh, we'll, we'll, have, we'll have plenty of time to, 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 to show stories. Definitely. Yeah, see, and he's more than welcome to come back anytime on the radio. Yes. You're, yeah, please come yeah. back. And um, if you had a fish story that we interrupted, you know, feel free to tell us and you could go back to it because we just kind of went yeah. sideways. We made a left at Albuquerque. <laughs> we <I felt>. did. <laughs> No, that's that's all right. You know, there's there's a lot of stories that uh, I'd like to share, and, and probably take the rest of your day to to hear them. But uh, we do have one a... of my favorites is. Um... Go ahead. I'm sorry. Go ahead. Look at me interrupting. I I, like we, I finally gave it back to Gabe, and then I interrupted again. Yeah. <laughs> well, I was just gonna say that we do have a fish story blog as well, uh, and so you know mm-hmm. we have the radio show. Which is broadcast pretty much all over the world. It's we have a following world, in though. Germany. Most of our following is in in the states. Yeah. And so, if you want to mm-hmm. say hi to anybody, this is going to go up on iHeartRadio, iTunes, Spotify, uh, Spotify. ITunes, it's all yeah. the all the the platforms that we're on. Um, we just got picked up on iHeartRadio, so yeah. you, people are going to be able to listen to you oh, there. Nice. Uh, and then we're live. We're live nice. via we're, our website, so we do yeah. have listeners uh, tune in and and tuning in. Um, all over, really. Yeah, yeah. Big like following a, on the East Coast. I yeah, mean, we have a lot here too, but it yeah, seems like you, you uh, have people on the East Coast listening to you right now, Gabe. You have people even possibly in Germany right now. I don't know what time it is there. I don't know what time it is either over but there. We, I'm not yeah. that smart to figure it out. <laughs> I mean, I guess but. we could look it up on our phones, but we won't. <laughs> no, so we're just gonna assume they're listening. <laughs> and I, you know, I don't know German. No, I don't. I don't know German. The, the, when you sneeze, you say Gesundheit. I know how to say wonderful. You would say and wonderful. Then a, I didn't even know that. I was going to say like Heineken. <laughs> You're a moron. Is that? It's probably not. It's not, probably not even. That's like that's Belgian, right? No, 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 no. No? Wrong spot? No. Yeah. I figured. Yeah. It feels like yeah. it's wrong. You're, you're better off just saying Oktoberfest. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> but anyway. Um, yeah, yeah so. I feel like we it just was like talking to one of our bunnies. This, this is great. That, that's honestly, uh, Gabe, like I said, talking with Gabe is like talking to our our, our buds. Only I mean, if he could see us, he, he would, would be not sadly talk, disappointed. He would not talk to us because Tommy and I are both wearing Merry Christmas hats with uh, antlers. Well, and he'll be he, able to see later on. He'll be able to see it later, but like I doubt anybody would be like, I'm not going to sit and talk to those guys. Well, I can guarantee I, nobody would really want to sit and talk to you. <laughs> I mean, I have to. There are most a lot of the times I'm like, I'm not going to make fun of Tommy today. Uh, I but never you wake go up, right for it. I never wake up with that. I just look at you and I'm like, <laughs> that's it. I'm gunning for him. But <laughs> well, thanks for coming on the show, Gabe. Yes, please continue to share the photos, thanks and we want to, we want to have fish stories. So we'll put them on, on the blog. The blog works the same way. Yeah, you, you just uh, where you caught the fish, uh, the bait you used, and then the photo. Yeah. Uh, and then you could say you're a blogger. Yeah. You are a, an article okay. writer. Cool. Yeah. You wrote an article. You're on. You know. You're on a website. You're. You've been on a radio show. I mean, let's let's be honest, Gabe. You're kind of a big deal now. Yeah. So you, you are you kind, kind of a big you deal. You kind of became famous. I mean, you know, you can you can tell your nephew, you know, who's who's up in Idaho, be like, hey, guess what. You, you caught know, that fish and you won that contest, but, but guess what happened to me? I'm famous yeah. and I'm on the radio now, so <laughs> man, fair trade. <laughs> well, thanks for having me, guys, and uh, you know, I enjoy talking to you guys. And uh, we'll have you back I on the show. To see you guys, and yeah, and we're gonna go visit to you. you guys. And yeah, we, we're right, cool, e- exactly. You know, anytime. You're more than welcome to come back on the show anytime. Just keep submitting pictures. 
Um, you know, we're gonna give away free stuff in just a second. Yeah, um, we're gonna be giving away some free stuff in just a bit on uh, on Facebook. We'll, we'll go YouTube first, live um, YouTube and Facebook, and and you have your chance to to win something. And uh, again, we'll see you again soon because uh, we'll make that trip and go cool. fishing with you. From all of us here all at right. Outsider yeah. Tackle Box, uh, I'll, I'll Mary... be waiting for you guys. That's right. You, you keep those beers cold. We're uh, we're we're gonna be heading that way. <laughs> Merry, Merry Christmas, Definitely. Gabe. Merry Christmas, tight Gabe. Have a good Merry one, Christmas, Gabe. Thank you, sir. Take right. care. Tight lines, right. bye. Bye-bye. Bye-bye. All right. Thanks.